but bears too. <laughs> and new stunning image is released from space. That's going to be good stuff. Cody Stark, Professor Cody Stark, wants to slap you with science. Anytime we can weave a bear story in right? something, that's what we're going to do. <laughs> All right, there's a new stunning picture that captures the mysteries of the galaxies. The Hubble's telescope captured this dazzling new picture of the spiral galaxy NGC 2903. The galaxy is part of the constellation Leo, and it's about 30 million light years from Earth. Uh, NASA used powerful telescope to explore over 100 further uh, swirling galaxies. Yes, Candy, it was indeed amazing. Amazing. Slap you with the science. All right, eating junk food is not only bad for humans, but it's bad for bears, too. Bears are scavengers, and they will eat human food if they're able to find it. But a new study shows that bears who ate sugary and high-processed foods, the less time the bears spent hibernating. They're hyper. Uh, researchers in Colorado studied black bears in the area. Normally, bears hibernated for about four to six months, which is when the females give birth. But researchers say that a lower hibernation time means that the bears age a lot faster. Which explains what's going on with me. Ah, uh, you know what I'm saying? It's the it's you with science. <laughs> By the way, she ran, fixed another camera, and ran up here to get slapped with the camera. That Bam! Was amazing. That was good. Uh, uh, astronomers say they are one step closer to understanding the mysterious atmospheric light known as Steve. This mauve uh, color last uh, light uh, appears east to west and much closer to the equator, followed by green stripes of lights. Now, researchers say that the satellite data reveals that uh, heated particles give Steve its mauve color, while electron showers from space create the green streaks. Based on a study, uh, researchers are just beginning to understand this natural phenomenon, but they have no idea which molecules give Steve its pink light. It's still a mystery. Steve. But they called it Steve. They called it Steve. He did. Slap with the science. There you go, Court. Over to you. All the slappage. All right. Thanks, Coach. Uh, we've got a packed show for you this morning. Want to break it down down with the producers, who Lisa is in the newsroom with What's on Tap for the rest of your morning.